Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving deep into the world of jaw-dropping speed and mind-bending engineering with a look at the top 8 fastest Pagani supercars. So buckle up, because we're about to go from zero to, are you kidding me, in no time. Let's hit it. So let's kick things off with a bit of a throwback. Meet the Pagani Zonda S. This stunner made its grand appearance in 1999, not too long after the Y2K scare. But let me tell you, the only thing you'd be scared of with this car is its monstrous 7.3-liter V12 engine, courtesy of Mercedes-AMG. Boasting 555 horsepower and 553 pound-feet of torque, this car was not joking around. Let's put those numbers in context. The Ferrari Enzo, often considered the first hypercar and also released in 2002, was its contemporary. The Enzo had more horsepower, but, get this, less torque. We're talking 485 pound-feet of torque, which is like bringing a knife to a gunfight. Sure, the Bugatti Veyron was strutting around with its 1,000 horsepower, but that's like comparing a sledgehammer to a finely crafted sword. The Zonda S was rumored to hit 220 miles per hour, which back in the day was like saying your pet hamster could beat Usain Bolt. Next up on our list, ladies and gentlemen, is the car so exclusive even the word exclusive feels left out. The Pagani Zonda Barchetta. This isn't just any car, it's practically a tailor-made tuxedo on wheels. Crafted in 2017 but hearkening back to the original 1999 Zonda design, it's a fine wine that's aged but still has the spunk of grape juice. Hold on to your seats because this one had a production run of just three models. Yes, you heard me right, three. That's fewer than the number of times you've probably lost your car keys this month. But get this, one of those lucky owners managed to crash this nearly priceless work of art. I don't know whether to cry or give them a medal for the world's most expensive fender bender. What sets the Barchetta apart is its unique blend of old school design and new age materials. It's as if Pagani looked at the Mona Lisa and thought, let's add some lasers. With a top speed of 221 miles per hour, it's like strapping a rocket to a piece of Renaissance art. Roll out the red carpet, folks, because coming in at number six is the Pagani Zonda 760 Ether Roadster. Oh yes, it's a one-off, which means it's like the Beyonce of Paganis. Only one exists in this dimension. Powered by a Mercedes AMG 7.3 liter V12, this beast churns out a hefty 760 horsepower, enough to make your grandma's knitting needles catch fire. Now, if you're thinking, haven't I heard of this before? You might be confusing it with the Zonda Cinque Roadster, which is its less powerful but equally sultry cousin. The Ether sets itself apart, not just in horsepower, but also in its unique color scheme and nuanced aerodynamics. You're not just driving a car, you're piloting a masterpiece that even Picasso would tip his hat to. And get this, back in 2019, this one-of-a-kind marvel was auctioned for $5.5 million. With the era of internal combustion engines winding down, the ether could be the last of the Mohicans. It's like the golden ticket wrapped in a bar of platinum decorated with diamond sprinkles. It embodies Pagani's one-of-one one philosophy, where a team of engineers and artists get together to create not just a car, but an experience that speeds down the highway at 223 miles per hour. Slide over ether and make some room for a dash of Parisian luxury. Enter the Pagani Huayra Hermes edition, where Italian speed meets French flair. This is the car you drive when you've got a black tie event at 8 but need to win a Grand Prix at 9. What's special here? Well, everything. But let's start with that hand-built engine. It's a 6.0-liter twin-turbo V12 signed by the very AMG technician who gave life to it, producing 750 horsepower and 735 pound-feet of torque. You know how most cars have cloth or leather seats? Please, this is Hermes we're talking about. The interior is an affair of exclusive design and luxury. It's like sitting in a mansion while breaking speed records. And don't even get me started on the unique color choices and laser-cut grills. This is a car you don't just park. You essentially valet it in the Louvre. What really sets this diva apart is its top speed, an exhilarating 224 miles per hour. The Hermes edition isn't just a high-speed wonder. It's a cultural fusion that shows what's possible when you take the very best of two worlds and put them together. Think of it as a supersonic croissant wrapped in an Italian flag cruising on the Autobahn. 
All right, speed demons and luxury aficionados, buckle up because number four on our list is the Pagani Huayra Carbon Edition. This isn't just a car, it's carbon fiber poetry in motion. Imagine taking everything you know about the lightweight strength of carbon fiber and then dialing it up to 11. We're talking a full carbon fiber body, wheels, and even interior trim. Yes, the glove box is probably stronger than your home's front door, but the innovation doesn't stop there. Pagani also threw in carbitanium, a cocktail of carbon composite and titanium alloy on the chassis and suspension. Think of it as the superhero of materials, offering an unbeatable combination of strength, lightness, and resistance to whatever the road throws at it. So yes, if Iron Man and Captain America were to have a car baby, it would be the Huayra Carbon Edition. Unveiled in 2012, this Dark Knight doesn't just look the part, it plays it too. With a top speed of 230 miles per hour, you'll be having an existential crisis about the meaning of speed as you zip down the road. In summary, the Huayra Carbon Edition is what you get when an engineering thesis and a work of art have a love child, and that child turns out to be an Olympic sprinter. Moving on, we have a car so exclusive it's like a secret society on wheels. Only five exist in the world, the Pagani Huayra Codalunga. Born out of an elite collaboration between two longtime Pagani customers and Pagani's own special projects division, known as Grandi Complicazioni, this car is the epitome of custom craftsmanship. The Cotalunga is a long tail version of the Huayra Coupe, and it's as elegant as a bespoke Italian suit. This isn't just a car, it's a rolling, road-hugging, haute couture fashion statement. Now Pagani's Grandi Complicazioni division is named after one of Horatio Pagani's design philosophies, which focuses on finding simple solutions for big problems. And boy, did they solve the problem of making a supercar that merges sublime design with outrageous performance. Don't get fooled by its elegant exterior. This car is an absolute beast with a top speed equal to the Carbon Edition, 230 miles per hour. With a price tag starting at $7.7 .7 million, owning this car is like having your name written in the stars. But the stars are diamond-studded and travel at the speed of light. So if you're ever lucky enough to spot a Cotalunga on the road, know that you've just seen one-fifth of a legend. Hold on to your racing gloves, folks, because sitting at number two is none other than the Pagani Huayra. Named after Huayra Tata, the Andean god of wind, this car doesn't just breeze by, it storms through. When this deity of speed awakens, you best believe you're in for some weather you won't soon forget. This car made its debut in 2011, and you'd better believe it brought the thunder. Its top speed is a subject of fierce debate. Some say 230 miles per hour. Others swear it's 238 miles per hour. Regardless, it's so fast that it only trails behind the Bugatti Veyron 16.4 Supersport for the title of the world's fastest street legal car. But unlike the Veyron, which is essentially a rocket on wheels, the Huayra is built for those twisty tracks, offering you a divine blend of speed and agility. And it's not just about going fast. With a twin-turbo V12 engine that churns out 750 horsepower and a whopping 735 pound-feet of torque, this car has the lungs of a dragon and the finesse of a ballerina. So if you're looking to be swept off your feet, or better yet, your tires off the ground, the Pagani Huayra is your one-way ticket to Cloud9. Well, well, well. If it isn't the piece de resistance, the Pagani Huayra are. This is not just a car, it's a temple of speed, a cathedral where horsepower is the gospel and top speed is the holy grail. And oh, what a grail it is. This track only wonder is rumored to have a top speed of a hair raising 240 miles per hour. Now, when you unleash 850 horsepower and 553 pound feet of torque from a naturally aspirated V12 engine, you'd expect the earth to shake and the heavens to part, and they do. The Huayra R is so ahead of its time that Pagani considers it a sort of test vehicle to shape the performance of future models. And get this, it redlines at a dizzying 9,000 revolutions per minute. At that point, you're not just driving, you're conducting a symphony of cylinders and turbochargers. Only 30 units of this celestial chariot exist, each with a base price of around $2.9 million, plus tax, of course, because even gods have to pay taxes, right? 
So there you have it, folks. The Pagani Huayra R is not just a car. It's a testament to human ingenuity. A reminder that when it comes to the art of speed, the sky, or should I say, the speedometer, is the limit. And there you have it, folks. The definitive list of the eight fastest Pagani supercars that have graced our roads and racetracks. Whether it's style, speed, or sheer engineering genius you're after, Pagani has you covered. Until next time, keep those engines revving and your spirits high. Take care and stay speedy.